Kia ora guys, it is your boy Skuxlux, welcome back. We're playing some more Banjo Kazooie. We're on to part 6 of our Let's Play series. And uh, we're actually 50% through the game, so... The previous video I did the snow stage free easy peek. And uh, I didn't quite get 100% in that stage, I have one more puzzle to get. Um, because I need to, to learn uh, the sprint shoot moves in order to race um, that fat bear. To get that last puzzle in that stage. But look at our time. We're on the 2 hours and 35 minutes and 30 seconds. And so far I've 100 percent at everything. I actually and yes, I did go back to Mumbo's Mountain and got that last honeycomb piece, if you're wondering that. <laughs> so uh, let's get into our series, guys. Let's continue on. So here we are, guys. We are back, and I'm about to fill in the sixth world's puzzle picture Gobi's Valley so here we go let's check all of those pieces in leaves me with 22 puzzle pieces and uh, as I mentioned I love this stage it's it's up there it's in my top three favorite stages of this game um, I'm hoping I still remember because there are some stages in here I just don't seem to remember I know the last two stages are my worst like I, I'm thinking about it now I'm not too sure if I'm gonna 100% those because Jeez, I don't know if I, have the, if I have the patience for it, but I'll try, I'll try. So, there it is, there it is. Okay, I I need to grab those gumboots. You know what? I'm just going to suck it up, and I'm just going to jump. What ifs, what ifs. Don't even care if I lose a life, because I hardly die anyway. I haven't actually died before. Six world, let's go. Welcome to Gobi's Valley. Jinjo right at the back of us. Oh my gosh. Okay, I didn't actually want to do that. There we go. First Jinjo of the stage and Bottles has explained to us uh, that there is one move in this, this world to learn, which is the sprint shoes. Ah, I love the song. Make our way all the way up the Sphinx here. Yeah, we've got a launch pad here, but what I want to do is jump down here. There should be some gumboots for me to use. Yep, so here we go. The gumboots that I learned, the moves that I learned in Bubble Goop Swamp part for my series. Check that out if you skipped that one. Um, but it just allows me to walk in a number of environments that are really dangerous. Like in this case, it's. Um, Apparently sinking sand with them. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Alright, okay. Alright. That's alright, that's okay. That is okay. I was ex I was definitely expendable. I thought it I thought it would have given me more time, but it didn't. No. Alright, I didn't want to I didn't want to use that yet. Oh, you got a mumbo skull. No. Oh, no. Oh, no. Hey. Do this guy here. All you do is wait for him to clamp down like that. Boom. Bob's your uncle. What I was meant to do is... The Sphinx has got like a blocked nose. So I want to actually clear it. And how do you clear it? Well by shooting eggs into his nose. Apparently that helps. Yeah, so there's no shaman in this stage. There we go. Let's just chuck a few of those in there, actually. Oh, yeah, no, that's sweet. And over to our last one. Boom, there we go. Opening him up, now I can go inside him. Never, never sounds right when I say that. Alright, I'll just collect these four notes around here first. Oh, actually, no. I'll just collect these two. Because I have to go all the way up there, grab that puzzle. Riding these magic carpets. 
Oh, get on. Uh, so there we go. If I shoot one into him, he should raise the cap it up. There we go. Now, I forgot to jump back because I, I guess, I think I heard a Jinjo. Yeah. I'll go back, I'll go back for that Jinjo, don't worry. And there we go, first puzzle of this world, and loving it, six minutes in. Right, let me just get these last two notes, oh, he wants to slam down, go for it buddy, and that's what happens, that's what happens when you do that to me. Alright, now I want to go back up there and grab that Jinjo. So shoot another egg in here. Go, number Jinjo number two. And I want to go back up to this launch pad. And I just want to fly through these rings here. one and I know with that one that one's back here somewhere two another one's just close by so what I'll do is I'll just come from the back I'm not too sure if this is a puzzle or not. I'm sure. I'm sure it just. No, I'm, it must be a puzzle. I don't. I don't really remember. Okay, and that's right by the Sphinx, so there may be the last one. It must be a puzzle. Yeah, it's got to be a puzzle. Only joking, mortal. We can only give you this. Ah, oh, yeah. Okay. Puzzle number two. Booyah! Let me fly up. Okay. Now, what I want to do, launch myself right over to over here. Okay, maybe I should actually came here last. Because I know there's a camel that shows up somewhere around here. So I've got to come back here anyway. But we'll go in here again. This is another one of those, you know, stop and swoop. Uh, you would have seen on the previous mission I got a ice key. And as I, I explained that this, these features were not implemented properly um, in the original version of the game. So I didn't actually get these back in the days. And here that's one of the seven stop and swap items. We've been looking for... I reckon it'll unlock something special in my Nuts and Bolts adventure. Can't wait. Yeah. What they also didn't mention is that the, sec the sequel to it as well, you unlock some cheats as well. Alright, wait for this carpet to come around. Thank you, kind sir. Alright. Let's continue. We're gonna go back up to my launch pad. And I wanna... I wanna see... Okay, that was a fail. And that was another fail. Okay. <laughs> Let's just line it up again. Just a bit impatient there. There we go. Oh my gosh! Why?
Why are you being so difficult, Banjo? Okay, let's give myself a bit of leeway here. Oh, a bit too high. Alright. We nailed it finally. So what I wanna do. Oh my gosh. No! No eight seconds. Wow. I am almost dead. This is the closest to death I have ever been on this game. I better I better watch myself. Oh, hello, my friend. I'm Ruby. Can I be of some help? No? We're looking for treasure, Piper. Very good. I see some up there. It's yours if you can get it. Yes? I don't know. I always seem to revert to like an Indian accent. Not sure if I'm racist or not. Well, we will go up there because there is a puzzle up there. What I have to do is fart some eggs. Oh my gosh. Get in a better position. Oh my gosh, fart better, Kazooie. Fart better. closer and I'm still failing one two three there we go ah a thousand thanks my friend his step will now help you with your quest there we go now all we do is climb right up here and get our third puzzle for this world we nailed it check to see if there's anything else in this no that's it well and that's that done ah we'll go learn this moves because bottles will give me some life I'm, I'm on the brink of death I can see the light at the end of the tunnel so we'll go learn the sprint shoes move master oh that's it because I've learned all the moves in the game Take your wisdom on her screw feet to make her run really fast for a limited time. Hmm, your energy is a little low. I'll fill it up for you. There we go. Thank you, Bottles. Well played, Bandit. Now you've learned all the moves in the game. So. Now all we have to do. Look at this. I do. I want to go down and get all these notes that are in the sand. No. Oh, lucky. Yeah, this guy thinks he's fast. Wait till I put on my sprint shoes. So I believe those are over here somewhere. Yeah, there they are. So let's go, let's go snatch that, uh, let's go snatch that jiggy off that hand. Easy as pie. <laughs> yeah, thousands of years, well done, Mono. Puzzle number four. Down and dusted. Okay, where do I want to go next? Oh! Yo! Have that. Ah, uh, oh, there's our camel there. That's what we wanted. Uh, 
Come on, where's the carpet? Wait for it to disappear. And then jump back on. Boom, there we go. Now let's feed this camel. You would have seen the plant at the beginning of this world. He was quite thirsty, so this camel was a lot of water for him. Puzzle number five. So this is Gobi the camel. He's a water. I kind of try and make the sounds like how they. Yeah, it's not working. Oh my gosh, what a fail that was. Oh, there's another ginger. What does this do? Ah, okay, cool. I just have to fly and get that. Because it's worth my life. Oh my gosh, the animation. Yes. Like wastes four seconds of your time, just bloody showing you where the door is, and you just really know where it is. Here come, oh come. Here come, oh come. All right, I like this. Is quite cool, actually. All right, you want to die? Yeah. This is like fishy, fishy. So I'm just gonna turn over the tiles and match them up. I've got 90 seconds, 99 seconds. That was there. Oh my gosh. Why did you do a big flip? That was there. No! Yep. Oh, that was over here. No, it wasn't. That was over here. Oh, what a guess that was. Ah, yes, that was in here. I do know where that is. Ah, oh, it's over here. Ah, oh, there we go. Easy as puzzle number six. Did miss it? Oh yeah, there's the no I missed. Oh, I don't want to fall down there. Okay, so what I want to do is shoot eggs into the sky, and if I do that, it should fill up this whole place with water, so it's a bit more safer for me. Oh no, actually he doesn't. No, he doesn't. He just opens up this, this pyramid. Oh well, I'll just carry on. Number two. Should be the last one. Gosh, that's a sketchy one. Boom, there we go. Revealing another pyramid.
Just get these notes up here. And there's a mumbo skull, get that as well. Oh, this is the tomb, that's right, this is a maze. Alright. Alright, let's go. Let's see if I remember where the way out is. I know there was a witch picture over here. Yep, let's hit that. Ah, I see. Here we go. Another puzzle on Kutil to see. Uh, well, which way I'm going? I'm just kind of guessing at the moment. Make my... No! No, no! No, no. Get out of my way. There it is, there it is. Go, 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 go! Ah, 20 seconds to spare. I was panicking there. Another Jinjo I can hear in here. Is there any other any other thing in here? No. Puzzle number seven. Alright, 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 as Mac Matthew McConaughey would say. Alright, alright, alright. Okay, now that's that pyramid done. Oh! No, no, no! Oh my gosh, oh lucky there's a launch pad here. Would have been just death. Okay, this is where I want to go actually up here. Actually, I remember this thing. Let's just fly through this cactus thing here and, and grab my honeycomb piece. Oh! Oh no! First try. Okay, now this should be the last pyramid here, so I need my sprint shoes for this one, because it is quite a race to the top. Yes, yes, I know, you're wa you're wasting so much seconds just doing this. My gosh. I'll come back for the notes later, i got to get up there fast. Oh my gosh, three seconds. Oh no! Oh my gosh. If it just, like, didn't waste so much time showing me what the heck it was opening up, I would just. No, let's do that again. Oh my gosh! You're kidding me! And I just killed myself. Yes! Oh my goodness! That was so tight. Here we go, puzzle number eight, guys. And there we go, emptying all our water out right into the other pyramid. Allowing me to get those musical notes down there. Oh, I missed one on the other one. Okay. I did, I did miss some musical notes actually on here. So I'll go back. Not very efficient, but... Oh well. Was that the only one I missed? I'm not too sure. I'm sure there was one more note on here. No? Okay, I got them all. Sweet. Alright. Now I can swim under here nice and safely.
almost all the notes done. Here we go. Puzzle number nine. And I know where the last one is. The last one is up here. We have done a fantastic job, folks. Here it is. 400 musical notes, done and dusted. Now we need the last puzzle, which I will show you right back at the entrance world. Get my 10th puzzle. And just abuse poor Gobi here. Just animal cruelty. Yeah, let me want it. Chocolate fruit's great. Now I actually have to go and grab my um, fly. I have to go actually fly on him. But it's all good anyway. Because I need to go. Alright, let's just get out of these. I need to go back to where I got that stop and swoop ad, um, egg. Because Gobi is back there now. Poor Gobi, he's gonna get stomped again from me to reveal um, the last honeycomb piece because I've only got I've only got one. Yes, yeah, so I've only got one out of two. So he's got the last one. So he's gone. He's gone over here to be a coward. Gobi, how's it going, mate? <laughs> Oh, the cruelty is real. To find some peace and quiet. Yep. So there we go, honeycomb piece. And sweet, we found six. We can get another life. So we've got, what is that, eight? All right, you know what? I'm just gonna carry on. Worth it. Taking its time. Go back to the launch pad. Get our last puzzle of the stage, and then that's it. This is that stage done, hundred percent. Boom, number 10. Duh, duh. Kobe Valley, all done. How long did that take me, actually? Turtle's Lair, Mumbo's Mountain, Treasure Trove. Kobe's Valley, 27 minutes, okay. Now, still got one more puzzle to get in there. So just for you guys, we're going to revisit Freezy Peak now and we'll race that bear and get our final puzzle for that stage. Let's go. Okay buddy, here's the rules. Run through the red. Yep, I know. Just like last time. Yeah, 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 yeah. You two won. Alright. But because I don't know these moves yet, I'm, I'm terribly slow. So this is what happens. So I have no chance, so see you later buddy, I'm off. <laughs> this is too easy. Oh, you wait! You wait, I'll be back! So here we are guys, welcome back to Free Easy Peak, the fifth world of this game. Now this bear robbed me of my victory, because I've got to race him a second time to get my last piece of the... my last puzzle piece for this world. But because I didn't know the sprint shoes, I had I didn't stand a chance against him. Now we do know that move, just learning it from our, our adventure in Gobi's Valley. Here we are, we're going to race him and we're going to shut him up for good. 
So here we go. Let's accept that. I'm ready this time. Yes, I know. I know. Let's just get on with it, mate. Boom, there we go. Come on. Come on, mate. No! No! Actually, yeah. No! Oh my gosh, it's in a jump. Oh, actually, jumping is actually much more faster. Yeah. Wipe that smirk of your face now, hey! Okay, it's actually not really that. Oh my gosh. Come on. Come on. Yes. Yes. Yes! Yes! Of course I'll take my last piece. And that is that, we have completed Freezy Pig 100% folks, finally. We did it. Boom, finally. We can move on without having to be not 100%. Alright, we're back just outside Gobi's Valley, guys. Um, I'm finally glad we got that last piece of the puzzle. Puzzle piece uh, for Freezy Prick. So he's now sitting at 100% for all the stages so far. So, Mumbo's Mountain, Treasure Trove Cove, 100%. Clanker's Caverns, 100%. Bubble Gloop Swamp, 100%. And now for Easy Peak, all puzzle pieces now 100%. And the world we just done, Gobi's Valley. And so, and all our stop and swoop. So, in Gobi's Valley, we, we um, unlocked a puzzle piece. Let's just get rid of him. It opened this part up. It opened this um, sarcophagus up there, right there. So we're going to get that. And that will be our seventh, no six, six Grintilda's Lair Puzzles. So, now what I didn't get before last time as well, is I actually didn't grab the Freezy Peaks puzzle, which was just up here. So we want to get that now, because again I had to learn the sprint shoes before I can even attempt to get this. Now, oh my gosh, it's right up there. So let's jump up here. make our way back up to that puzzle oh crap no that's not what I want not yet not it not yet anyway let's just get this mumbo skull oh, so this is gonna reveal a launch pad Right in that gap there, so I just want to actually sprint to that. If I can make it, come on! Come on! Oh, I just missed it! It's because of that stupid camera angle. My goodness. Try that again. Boom. Yes, yes. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Yes. We got there, folks. <laughs> and now all we have to do is fly right up there and grab that puzzle piece. There it is. It's been hiding for us for a while. 
Number s puzzle number seven for Gintilda Slayer. So let us make our way back. And now we want to go and open the seventh world of this game. A spooky world. I don't know what I did that for. Absolute no idea. Alright. Now we have Gobi's Valley right there. Now we want to go, this is a spooky, spooky world one. This is where we want to go next. This is the entrance to that world. But, I need to finish the video here guys. We will find the puzzle picture frame and fill that in in our next episode. So stay tuned for that. And uh, if you like this video, make sure you hit that like button. And also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. To keep up to date with the latest Let's Plays and playthroughs on Banjo-Kazooie and other games I play as well. Um, but until the next video guys, from me here in New Zealand. Kakite Anu.